A white nationalist who lived in Rock Hill and once ran for the U.S. Senate has been arrested more than 500 miles away. His name is Augustus Invictus. He was taken into custody in Brevard County, Florida, on a warrant out of South Carolina. NBC Charlotte's Kendall Morris is live over in the newsroom with more on this story. Kendall? Good evening to you, Bill and Sarah. Invictus is being held on an out-of-state warrant. He faces a laundry list of charges, including kidnapping and domestic violence. Now, this arrest happened on Monday afternoon, and it all stems from an incident that started on December 12th in South Carolina. The suspect's wife reported that Invictus came home in Rock Hill, threatened her with a gun, and forced her to leave with her children to go to Florida with him. She and her children were able to escape and report the incident. Now, Invictus was the headline speaker for a Unite the Right rally in Charlottesville in 2017. Three people were killed at that event, including a 32 year old counter protester. Earlier that year, he ran a failed bid to unseat Senator Marco Rubio on the Libertarian ticket. Invictus is listed on the Southern Poverty Law Center as a promoter of white supremacy and someone who questions whether the Holocaust happened. Now, right now, he is being held without bond in Brevard County. Reporting live in the newsroom, Kendall Morris, back to you. Kendall, thank you. New information.